This is James Helder for iFilm London. I'm in the West End of the Piggy Premier. With me, I've got my friend and the, and the wonderful actor, Roland Manukian. How are you, Ro? I'm very well. Very well, James. Very well indeed. How good does it feel to finally have this film coming out? Uh, we're at the premiere today. Massive for Piggy. Tell us a little about it, bro. Yeah, it's, uh, it's re it feels really good to get the film up and running, get a release on the film. Very much looking forward to it. Uh, formidable performance by Paul Anderson. Yep. Formidable. Uh, yeah, very exciting times. Very exciting. I spoke to um, Danny Potts earlier. He said they knew as soon as Paul walked in the room for the audition, the geezer had the part. They just knew he, he, the way he carried himself, the way he carried himself through the film. Fantastic, absolutely fantastic. Yeah, I think he's uh, set for uh, big, big things. Big things, Paul Anderson. Wonderful actor. Have you had the chance to watch the film, The Final Cut, all put together yet, Ro? And if so, what's your thoughts on it, mate? Uh, I've not seen a locked-off uh, film, so I see a very early film, no grade. Uh, the final score wasn't put to it, but uh, I was very, very pleased with it. I think Kieran's done a fantastic job, considering he's a uh, first-time director. I think he's assembled a wonderful cast, he's a great writer. It's very cinematic, so I can't wait to see it on the big screen. Absolutely brilliant cast these guys have put together. I know Kieran Hawkes is, is directorial debut, debut and, and to work with such great actors and, and such a big performance, it can only bring him on to bigger things again. I hope so. I hope for Kieran. I hope, I hope this film gets uh, well received uh, on many fronts, not only for his kind of uh, for his. Uh, his work as the director, but also for cinematography, for James Friend, who's done an amazing job, for the score, which I think was particularly brilliant. Uh, I think it's the lead guy from the Coral. Or, but your score is absolutely wonderful. Roland, having worked with you on this film and having watched you work, the banter and camaraderie we had on this film and set was just fantastic, second to none. Do you, do you think this kind of camaraderie and vibe is going to be continued working with Danny Potts and his production company? Are they on a good run? What's going on? Was you in this film, James? Actually, I wasn't. I'm, I, I was in charge of the EPK, so oh, you might remember me lurking about, oh, kind of pestering you. you. In the film. I missed that. I missed that altogether, mate. Oh, but I have to work harder. I am, I, I'm, I'm actually gutted. I really won't. I actually am. It touched me and hurt me, you know. But. Well, I think the most important thing is uh, for independent, low-budget uh, British films, uh, this is at the forefront of them, I think. Uh, most of them are usually shit, uh, but this is a gem. Uh, amongst the, you know a, a, it's very difficult to find one of these gems basically that's what I'm trying to say and I've, I really think it is and I think that's down to Paul Anderson being brilliant in it like one of the best performances I've seen in a very very long time up there with a Ray Liotta performance in Goodfellas up there with a Robert De Niro in Raging Bull he won't like me saying all this but that's how good I think he is I think Martin Compton has done an amazing job as well I must not forget him he's the lead in it Neil Maskell's a wonderful actor he's done a great job as well I, I really think it's been put together wonderfully what else have you been up to this aside what have you been up to recently Mo? give us a little insight mate uh, talking of low budget films I've done a couple of shit low budget films recently uh, but you've got to work as an actor, as they say. Uh, indeed, so you've got to pay the bills and keep yourself moving. All right, I'm not going to take up too much of your time. I really appreciate you taking the time to talk to me. And, you know, it's always good to catch up with you. Peace to Bahrain. As he says, peace to Bahrain. And I hope you enjoy the film. Thanks. James Holder, Roland Manukian for iFilm London.